Welcome. Mid ordinate rule. Use the mid ordinate rule to estimate the area and close by the curve. Y is equals to x squared minus 9. X axis and the lines x is equals to 2. And x is equals to 5 using 6 strips. Using 6 strips. Now, we need to just write this interval we are given here. Between 2 and 5, if we just write these are 2, 3, then we have 4 and 5. And remember, we using the mid-ordinate rule, we use the center of each strip, the mid-ordinate. For example, this is one strip. That is one strip. This one is another strip here. This one is another strip. So if we want to use the mid-ordinate rule, we shall use the center of this strip from 2 to 3 we shall have uh, 2.5 that is what we shall take and uh, between um, 3 and 4 the mid ordinate is 0 0.5 then again here the mid will be 4.5 so you notice that these are just three strips that we have used and we have extracted the mid ordinates of those strips they're not enough. So we need six strips. So to get six strips, we need to expand this one more. We need to make sure that the size of this strip is smaller. Not from two to three. We need to create another one here. So um, we shall take two. Then uh, we look at 2.5. Then from, then this one is a three. Then from 3.5. Then from four. Then uh, 4.5, let's see if this one will work, then up to 5. So if we try to use that one, uh, assume that this one strip, um, then if we pick the mid ordinate, for example, we pick one here, the mid of that strip, the mid of this strip, let me just use it like this, the mid of this strip, then the mid of this strip, the mid of this strip, in the middle of this strip, uh, you notice that I'll have now, this is uh, 1, this will be 2, this will be 3, this will be 4, 5, and 6. This only work because these are 6 strips. How am I counting the strips? 2 to 2.5 is one strip. Pick the mid of that strip. From 2.5 to 3, that is another strip. Pick the mid of that strip. From 3 to 3.5, that is another strip. Pick the mid of that strip. From 3.5 to 4, that is another strip. Pick the mid of that strip. So that is how I have arrived at these uh, points here. These are the mid or the drone I'm going to use. So I have to prepare another table here. X and Y. We prepare that table. And in this table I'm going to use here, I will now extract the mid ordinates. Now you've seen uh, the first strip uh, is from 2 to 2.5. The mid of that strip will be 2.25, 2.25, 2 2.25. Then the mid of the other strip from 2.5 to 3 will be 2.75. The mid of this strip from 3 to 3.5, you get 3.25. The other strip uh, from 3.5 to 4, that would be 3.75. Then the other strip from 4 to 4.5, you get 4.25. Then from 4.5 to 5, that is another strip. The mid of that strip is 4.75. Five, so that is how you arrive at these six strips. So you have to expand this one further in order to have six strips. The way it was, these were just the one, two, they were just three strips. So you had to expand until you get the six strips. So this is one strip, and the strip is here, another one like that. There are six strips. So now, after doing that, uh, extracting the mid, these are the, the mids. Of these strips so now we can uh, 
after doing that now we can use a calculator to get the ordinates uh, we're using this uh, equation y is equals to x squared minus 9 so this is the equation that we're going to use so we just substitute the values of x when x is 2.25 we substitute there so use a calculator to do this very fast so use a calculator to do this so the first one uh, the equation that you're using don't forget this is the equation that you're using it is here so x squared x squared minus 9 minus 9 so when x is um 2.25 2.25 will be 3 negative 3 point three seventy five then when it is uh, the next one 2.75 2.75 to be negative 1.4375 1. like that and when it is 3.25 3.25 to be 1.5625 rub that so point the other one is uh, 3.75 3.75 it will be 5.0625 so the next one is uh, it is uh, 4.25 9.25 And the last one here, when it is a 4.75, this will be 13.5625. So those are the mid ordinates. So we have extracted the mid ordinates. Now it is time to get the area. So how do we get the area using the mid ordinate? So area using the mid ordinate rule is given by height multiplied by the sum of the ordinates this is how we get the area we approximate the area using the mid ordinate rule area is equal to height multiplied by the sum of the ordinates now which is the height this is the height of each strip and which are these strips like this is uh, the strip this is one strip this one strip the other strip is starting from 2.5 to 3. The other strip starts from 3.3 .3 to 3.5. The other strip from 3.5 to 4, 4.4 to 4 to 4.5 and so on. So the height of each strip, this is where we get the height. So from 2 to 2.5. So the height will be given by uh, 2.5 minus 2. And this will give a uh, height to be 0 0.5 the same to these from 2.5 to 3 that is another strip you notice is 0 0.5 from 3 to 3.5 the height is 0 0.5 so 0 0.5 then multiply by the sum of the ordinates we add everything here you can see we have uh, the first one is negative negative 3.9375 then plus negative this negative one point this will still be negative one point four three seven five plus one point fifty six twenty five plus five point zero six twenty five plus nine point zero six twenty five plus 13.5625 so that is what you're supposed to do so we we'll use a calculator to do this use a calculator to do this to add everything that is here so let me push it a bit up here
so we add so 0 0.5 multiply by so the first one is negative 3.9375 negative 1.4375 plus 1.5625 plus 5.0625 plus 9.0625 plus 13.5625 so the answer will be 11 point so this will be 11.93 seven five square units so that will be the area square unit so that is simply how we estimate the area using the mid ordinate rule